Hi friends! I hope everyone's doing super dandy today because for today's video you can't see but we're here at the thrift store we're here at value village and we're doing some thrifting which i am so excited about because i haven't been thrifting in i want to say over a month now so i am just very pent up with thrift energies thrift vibes and just you know feeling really great about this thrift trip today. Don't really have many plans other than maybe get myself some last minute Christmas gifts and maybe something for my husband. I don't know. Maybe more yarn, fabric, cute clothes. I don't, I don't know. I just, no plans today. So let's just head in and let's see what they have here today. This one, I like you. You look nice and fuzzy. You're a pretty color too. I really don't need any more yarn, but yet again, I'm here looking at the yarn. It's, oh God, yeah, it's not, it's not great. So I'm going to try not to get any, except the one in my cart and maybe more. I don't know. I actually, I can't promise that. There is only one quilt here. Unfortunately, this is it. This is the only quilt I found. It's very, very colorful. Very, very, what's a word? I don't know. I don't know if I can see myself wearing this as a jacket. It's also a little small. Wait, wait, wait. There's actually two more quilts here this one which it has two different sides but you can see it's super thin like this is in the duvet oh it's a duvet cover yeah there's two duvet cover quilts here for some reason i just feel like starting in the jeans today so that's where we're gonna start okay these are too tiny where's my size whoa ho, ho. look at these bad boys wow Wowza. I found some gap overalls here, although they do kind of have like a little skinny bottom here. And usually I'm not a huge fan. These Oaken Fort jeans are just, they're beautiful. I want them, although they aren't my size. Cool. <gasps> overalls, another pair of overalls. Look at those. But they are kind of a gray, kind of silvery color. And I'm not sure if I'm a huge fan. Don't know. I kind of feel like conductor vibes with these overalls. You know what? This is a nice sweater. Look at this. It's like a giant hoodie, but it's not a hoodie. It's, well, technically, I guess you can call it a hoodie. But you know, it's a sweater. It's a nice, chunky, big sweater. I would get it because I really do love it, but I just don't think I'd wear it. And it's so ginormous. This would take up half my, my closet. But I did find this one. Look at this sweater. Doesn't this look like something you just want to be wrapped in all winter? And yes, it's as soft as it looks. It is just um, a dream. So this is my only sweater I've found so far. There you go. You know what really sucks is when you're thrifting and you see someone with really good finds or one or a few good finds in their cart. It just sucks because now you know you, you can't find that item. It just happened to me where I saw this you know lady walk by with a llama bowl and matching llama. I, I think it was a salad bowl, so it came with like the salad fork. So, is that a fork and a spoon? Kind of angry I didn't go to the home decor section first. You know what? I don't want to miss out on any other llama decor pieces, so we're going to the home decor section. Yep, we're going. And then we're going to the scarves. Just in case you're curious. So we're just gonna take a quick break from the thrifting because today's video is actually sponsored by True Earth. They are this amazing Canadian company that is actually local to me and they make these eco strips for washing your clothes. <sighs> They're incredible. So I have been using their eco strips for over a year and a half now and it's the only laundry detergent we use in our household. And the reason why I love it so much is one, 
This is a whole year supply of laundry detergent and look how compact it is. Two, there is no plastic whatsoever and it's 100% recyclable, the packaging. And three, these are pre-measured. So every single time I do the laundry, I don't have to get my hands sticky with the liquid detergent. I just have to open this box up, take one of these, rip it apart and throw this into my laundry. This will wash a whole load of laundry. Crazy. You can buy their eco strips in a whole bunch of different load sizes from 32 all the way up to a year supply of 384 loads. As for scents, they have a whole bunch. I have the fresh linen, but you can also get it in fragrance free and a baby one. If you guys want to get 10% off your eco strips, be sure to use my coupon code FIPS10 at checkout and you guys will get 10% off your whole order. Be sure to use my link down below in the description and thank you so much to Truth for sponsoring today's video. Ooh, look at this jacket I just found. Let's put this in the cart. Well, the home decor section was pretty successful, I would say. So for shoes, this is my most unsuccessful area in the thrift store. Oh, those are kind of cute. ASOS, look brand new too. <gasps> Ooh, look at these checkered. $12. I kind of like these. I, I'm in the wrong section, so that's probably why I don't do well here. I'm in the 10s, but I like these. Are they clogs? Okay, this is more my section, seven, seven and a half. But I'm kind of between. I'm like a seven and a half, eight sometimes, so I just like to go through all the sections for the shoes. Ooh, there's cowboy boots here. Don't really need another pair. Look at those bad boys. Those are those are not so bad so I think these are men's shoes but these are so crazy they're neon orange shoes I really want this tree train but I know my husband's not gonna like that on our tree okay a few things I gotta show you guys that I'm not getting one I'm not gonna get this patchwork jacket. It's really nice and I really do like it, but I'm just like, mm, I don't know. It's just like not 100%, you know? So I found this one scarf and I've been looking for a scarf like this that's like super skinny and long, but I don't know if I'm like super in love with the colors. I'm also thinking of maybe doing like a little thrift look with it where I'm like adding yarn to it and maybe like extending on or just like doing embroidery or something on it which I think could be really fun. So this one's a maybe, it's a maybe. I think that's it that I put in my cart that I'm actually gonna put back now. Everything else I found, I think I'm gonna get, I think. So I just finished up in the thrift store. I have a good haul for you guys, but before we go home, I do want to show you guys one item just because it's for my husband. And when I go home, he's there and he's going to hear me talking when I'm doing the thrift haul. So I don't want to spoil this Christmas present for him. So I'm just going to show you what I got him. I got him this big Burberry scarf. Like it doesn't say Burberry on it, but you know, the Burberry pattern. And the only reason I got him this is because we kind of have this joke where Benson, he has this rain jacket that is also like similar pattern to this. And he always says like, it's his Burberry jacket. So I, I just want to get him Burberry too. And Benson's jacket is not Burberry. It's from a dog store. 
It probably doesn't make sense, but he's always saying Burberry for some reason, so I thought I could get him this because I saw this there. I, I know that wasn't very exciting at all, but everything else I got is for me, so I have a good thrift haul to show you guys, but I do need to run some errands before I go home, so I'm going to do that, and then I'll see you guys at home for the haul. The haul. Okay. I am so angry with myself right now. I'm just... <laughs> I'm very angry. I did something and um, I'm really upset. I'm really upset that I did this because we're starting off our haul with a little bit of a disappointment and uh, I'll just show you. You know the tea mug that I was really, really excited about because it's my favorite color and like it's a tea mug? Well, I already broke it. And uh, I don't really know how I did this. I think these like just like hit each other when they were in the bag. And I cannot find the piece that broke off. So I'm assuming it's in like the parking lot there. I'm not really sure because it's not in my car. It's not on, you know, the path of getting to my car to here. It's nowhere. I cannot find it anywhere. I looked forever and um, she's broken. And I don't know how to fix her. Well, I guess that we're on the home decor train. I might as well show you the next home decor piece. And luckily, it's not broken and it's also glass, so at least I didn't break everything. This is the next piece, which I'm also so excited for because I don't have a teapot and I love tea. Like, tea is like my favorite thing to drink. I just love it in the wintertime. And when people come over, I just do like one tea bag per person, but I kind of want to be old fashioned and do like a teacup and then everyone kind of, you know, shares it, right? So I found her. I've never seen one like this. This really reminds me of Jeff Koons, you know, like the balloon animal sculpture. Yeah, I am just like so excited for this. This is like a piece of art, my teacup now. I'm very excited for you. So for clothes, I did get a few tops, so I'm gonna start with the top, and then I did get this one. <laughs> Fancy dress, which I have no idea where I'm gonna wear it, but I just saw it and fell in love with it, so I bought her. But I'm not showing you her yet. We're gonna go with this one first. I just found this basic white sweater here. It's originally from H&M and I just need more basics just because I like layering like I like just putting like a sweater vest on top or putting another sweater and just you know put my knits over top. I just I just want more layering so I found this one. I should just try it on for you guys instead of just holding it up. What do we think y'all? She's just a basic shirt, like, <laughs> it's like not much to say about this other than I really, really do like the length of her because some of my shirts are a bit longer and it's kind of like an awkward length where then I have to tuck it in, but then every time you go to the washroom, you have to like re-tuck it in, otherwise it's just like hanging weird and I just don't like it. So I just like shirts that are just like the perfect length, because then I don't have to worry about them when I go to the washroom every time. And she was $8.49. Does anyone care? I don't know. But she was. Next item is this shirt here. And also, I have a bra on it. It kind of looks like I'm naked because it's like pretty much my skin color. But next one, this blouse I got. It was $9.99. I got her for layering again. I think a lot of the items I got were just for layering. No, just this item and the last item for layering. And what I thought for this shirt was, I could wear that blue sweater vest over top. It's got blue in here, the shirt, blue stripes, so I thought it would match perfectly. Oh yeah, I like that. Yeah, yeah, I like this. Next, I think this was the first sweater I showed you guys. I'm not sure, I don't really remember now, but I found this fuzzy sweater and it's so soft and cozy. I don't know if I'll just wear it by itself without a shirt. No, I probably would wear a shirt underneath it, but I'm not right now. But this is the next item. It's got like a huge collar, which I don't know. Are you supposed to zip it up the whole way? I don't think so, unless you fold it. Oh, okay, that actually looks pretty good. Like a turtleneck here, that actually is kind of handy. I didn't even think about that. Oh yeah. I kind of like that, but here's another basic one. I've been very basic today, other than just like the striped 
shirt. I, nah, it's not really last set. It wasn't that basic. I guess the two home decor pieces were kind of pow. And my last item. I got this dress from, you know, like the fancy section where they have all like the prom dresses, the old wedding dresses. Yes, that section. I found this dress there. It's a vintage one. And it's just like the most beautiful slip kind of dress. I don't know if you call it a slip dress, but you know, that type of like kind of dress. I'm a little nervous. This is not going to fit. But we will try. We will try. <laughs> yeah. Okay, I have my final thoughts on this one. I look like a man in a dress in this one for some reason. Kind of short, just kind of riding up in the arms, just... I look like a man chest in this dress. No boobs, very wide, doesn't fit here, very short. I have a man's chest. Like, I gotta admit, I do look kind of like a little bit buff in this dress. <laughs> I'm not sure that I'm liking it, but you know. Cause really the only problem is, is this right here. And technically it fits around here, but it's like riding up under my arms and it's just not flattering in this area, so. I just look like a man in this dress. Well, that is it for today's video. So I hope you guys enjoyed thrifting with me today. If you liked it, let me know down in the comment which item was your favorite. Please don't tell me it's the tea cup, the broken one. Don't tell me that after I broke it. But that's it. So I'm going to go have a great rest of your day and I'll see you guys all in my next video. Bye.